Welcome guys, it's some massive update news coming to Legend of Mushroom and the one thing we've always been waiting for. The ability to set your skills off auto or on auto with even the timings to get the perfect combination all together. So let's go into this brand new update that's coming to Legend of Mushroom. Hey, hello everyone, yes, smash the like, comment, and subscribe for more daily videos of me, Mr. Sneak, and the one and only official Legend of Mushroom content creator and sponsored by Aptoid. So just remember, if you want to use my code, a little pop-up, boom, should just be popping up right now with the 5% bonus code on all of your purchases with my code, Mr. Sneaky. So just put that in for the whole month of May, you're going to be buzzing, right? So what we're going to be talking about though is this brand new update, right? This is the update sneak peek so we can have a look and obviously give this information out to you guys so you can get hyped and prepare for it, right? So in this brand new content, we do know of the marriage system. So the marriage system is coming in, but the one thing I really want to talk about is skill delay. So the skill delay says PVE custom delay. In the automatic skill release menu, you're going to be able to, players are going to be able to customize the rhythm of skill release for six active skills and at, at a set delay of zero to 10 seconds for each skill to meet the needs of manual operation and battle strategy. That is insane, guys. Absolutely massive in the game because you're probably wondering, what does this mean, Sneaky? What does this mean? Well, pretty simple. As you can see, I kind of run a lot of the time on auto. I am one of those bad players that does just let the game run in the background, but it's doing its job and it's honestly, I've had no problems with it. Obviously, I know I can probably push through a lot deeper if I focused a little bit more and chose my skills correctly. And what this game is talking about is basically stuff like your healing combinations, right? So in this game, you could be running stuff like the Shroom Shield here, and you could be running stuff like the Blitz Assault, which gives you damage immunity, or you could be running even the Pog Champ, you know, Nature's Renewal. And the problem is when you have obviously Auto on, it's gonna heal and shield at the same time, or it's gonna give you the shield and immunity at the same time and that's something you don't want to do so what you're able to do now and which is going to be really good and can't wait to get my hands on it is basically set a timer delay and that's very very important because that means what you could do is have your damage immunity from blitz assault zero seconds so you know this comes off at the start this is going to last for three seconds in the game and what you could do then is then make sure your shroom shield is gonna apply with a two second delay or a three second delay depending on obviously what's best in the game we'll have to find all that you know fine tuning out but that's really good right we're not wasting any skill timings and this is even better as you can imagine with damage skills right so if you're a damage dealer you could be doing stuff like smoke bomb on zero and then making sure because it's on zero any of your big spells like your windborn arrows your crimson your you know dragon resonance just all these insanely powerful damaging spells that you've got you're going to be able to make maximize all of that damage and on top of this you can do some even more funkier stuff and this could create honestly a brand new meta of class skills because what you could do is in theory right make sure star array goes on and then one second later have the attack speed so you gain all of that time almost together and get maximum beneficial on it right so i really do enjoy it i think this is gonna be a really good feature when it comes into the game and i think everyone has been waiting for this especially in an idle game for legend of mushroom right so if we go back into the update <coughs> You can see there's going to be a brand new limited time event, as you can imagine, with a loved theme of costumes, wings, artifacts that will go live. And the costumes are, as you can see, Cat Princess and Dog Knight theme. So it's going to be animal love theme to kind of go with the marriage event, right? So let's have a quick look at this marriage system, what they've got here. And it gives you a nice kind of 
decent up understanding of it, right? So when the intimacy with your friend reaches the highest level, you can choose to bond with your friend. And that can only be a one-time bonding object. After marry, you will get a new title of intimacy and unlock a new level of intimacy and corresponding rewards. So what this basically means is in the game, you're going to be able to go to your you know, friends area. So if we go there right now, you're going to be able to go into like your social area, go to your friends and you can see how we have this 810, right? Me and my boys are crazy up there, right? With all of the big love and job. But once this maxes out, basically what's going to happen is you're able to bond more, right? You're going to be able to bond together and become a married couple. But by doing that, you're going to get some extra rewards for doing so. As well, as we go back into it, it does continue on to say the bonding level reaches the highest level. You can unlock the wedding that both mushrooms, after going through a series of processes such as proposing, booking the wedding, sending invitations, organizing the wedding vows, and etc to complete the wedding and other mushrooms which is even funnier in your whole server can visit the wedding and after the marriage of the mushrooms can be together to improve the affinity and concentric lock level and, and, and unlock more exclusive rewards and live a happy life that was a tongue twister there that end <laughs> but you can see it's a really cool little system it's just a way as you can imagine if you and your buddies who that might be in a group that's been playing together for such a long time you can basically make this a little bit more of a humorous social aspect you can marry to one of them you can start making jokes about who's going to keep the kids and who's not going to keep the kids and stuff like that and i kind of love it i really really do love it and on top of all of that to finish yourself we do have some nice images to go over right so this is kind of the costumes and what the wedding event kind of is going to look like so you can see the little cat costume the dog knight i didn't think the dog knight one looks Oh, okay, <laughs> it's not something I'm going to go for, obviously, but it looks okay compared to the, the cat princess one. I'm not a fan of the cat princess, but boys, the actual wedding ceremony and this whole area looks great. It actually looks really great. So I can't wait to jump into here, see what is, all these rewards are. And obviously, as you can imagine, I'm going to upload and give you that information straight away. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and this new update coming to legend of mushroom and if you have you know what to do guys smash like comment and subscribe to my channel and on with all of that use the promo code right five percent promo code right there from aptide on your app coins wallet and it supports me so massively in this month of may so with everything said with all the new teasers out stay safe guys stay sneaky peace out